everyone, and welcome back to Comic Book Issues. I'm your host, The Last Angry Geek. It's time for another one of our YouTube channel exclusive Loot Crate unboxings. This time it's the November, I know it's December, but they got this one to me a little late. November 2017 Loot Crate, and the theme is Unite 2.0. They did a previous Unite box. They're using that theme again, so hence the 2.0. Uh, as I mentioned previously, this is my second to last Loot Crate. Uh, I'm off the monthly brand after three years. December will be my last one when I get that, probably in February. Uh, I'm still going to be doing the new bi-monthly Fallout box, but for now, my time with the monthly Loot Crate is coming to an end. So, let's see what they sent us. I know there's some Overwatch here, a lot of uh, team things. First off, we have the t-shirt. Put that there. Oh, this is cool. This is a cool one. Voltron. Legendary Defender. I've been watching that series. I love it. And it's uh, kind of an 8-bit... Uh, not exactly an ugly sweater kind of design, but you know, it's just, it's like the 8-bit uh, uh, video game art for Voltron. But this is a really nice shirt. This is sometimes they go cheap on the shirts and just do a quick screen print. This has kind of that uh, rubbery feel to the art, and the cloth feels really nice. Let's let's try it on. Oh, yeah, this feels nice. It looks cool. Uh, I'm really a big fan of Legendary Defender. I've really enjoyed that series. Uh, so this is just uh, really cool. We got the pilots down here, the paladins, we got the lions, and then we got the big Voltron head. They never explained how they knew lions, the space aliens who built the robots. Just a little continuity thing. But they have cows in space, so who knows. Uh, this is, I think, the Funko Pop. They spoiled this on the website. They're spoiling items on the website. I don't like that. That's another reason I'm leaving. Time to get up. Oh! Oh, but this is the Loot Crate exclusive Widowmaker Pop Funko from Overwatch, which I have still not played, but a lot of people seem to like, so you gotta give it to Blizzard. They know how to make uh, people-pleasing games. Uh, her rifle is a little bent, but that's okay. I like Funko Pops. That's me. I'm not, I've, I've gone on and on about the Q-Figs when I got them. They're okay. Let's see what else they sent us. The comic books this time was the first two issues of Faith and the Future Force. I already got those. I'm not sure what the digital item will be. Oh, or maybe I knew, maybe I don't know. Oh, this is Power Rangers Unite. I'm in a lot of trouble with this box today, folks. It's just small enough that it fits there, but it's a little too big to do it easily. Uh, it's Morphin Time, empowered by five teenagers, Reader Pulse, etc., etc. Contains one figure and one base. They've been doing a lot of collectible figures. I think they must have bought a figure company because they did the Thor one and the Aliens one before that. So this minifig is Power Rangers. Watch as I cut my finger off. No, I didn't. Next time. Before the series is up. I How about that? And I have Trini. Or was it Boy? In Zero Ranger. But... Well, this is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, so this will be uh, Trini. Oh, and they all, uh, the base is all kind of locked together. You can see, I'll turn it around. So I'm sure you'll be able to get the other Power Rangers on uh, Loot Vault's website. Loot Vault is where they sell the stuff that they didn't move in the boxes. But that's nice. That's the uh, Yellow Ranger, the uh, Sabertooth Tiger Ranger. Not a dinosaur, but still counted as a dinosaur. Who knows why? If you ever watch Zeo Rangers, man, that show is a trip. That if you think you have logic problems with Power Rangers, Zeo Rangers, whew, next level. We have oh, this is cool. A ten dollar gift card to VRM Premium, which is a streaming service for what is this? Anime, animation, fantasy, games, comedies, and thrillers. Okay, that's cool. This is awesome. This is neat. We have a replica, they did this before with uh, Ashton Comics number one, the first Superman comic. This is the first appearance of the Justice League of America. This is a reprint of Justice League of America, Brave and the Bold Presents, number 28, versus Star of the Conqueror. That's awesome. I like, I love getting comic books, you know that. I'm going to check that out. The uh, reprint of Action Comics from uh, earlier in the year was really amazing. What do we have? We have a 10% off coupon for Loot Crate. The Unite 2.0 magazine. So yeah, the Power Rangers all fit together. No Green Ranger? No Tommy? What a chip. 
Man's an eighth-level black belt. Oh yeah, the DLC this month was Batman the Telltale series, the first season. They're on the second season now. That's a really good game. So you should enjoy that. Um, so, okay, this was a pretty good box. Uh, I like the Power Ranger figure. I love the t-shirt. I love the comic book. Uh, I forget the, the Overwatch Funko Pop. That was spoiled for me, and, that's, and I don't play Overwatch, so that was kind of... Uh, but the next one is going to be Explore, and it's going to have Star Wars stuff in it, and they're going to include in the box a random item from one of their other loot crates to kind of sample it out, but let's be honest, it's probably all from Loot Pets, because that line is shutting down. Okay, thank you for joining me, everyone. I'll see you here next month for the final monthly Loot Crate unboxing. Until then, this is Comic Book Issues, and I'm your host, The Last Angry Geek. What does the box turn into? I knew you were going to ask that. Oh my god, the box turns into Zordon! Rangers, I need teenagers with attitude to clean my lawn.